I think there's a speaker over there. <laughs> okay, Craig. Oh. <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> I'm an oinker. We just got off Leviathan several times today, and we've been talking about this this whole season. There's something different about it. Would you agree? Yeah. It feels so much faster, and a lot of you know that Yukon Striker should be my number one at this park. Oh. And Behemoth last year was my number one. And I used to get a lot of hate for it, and that is not why my opinion has changed. Oh. I, it, it is. I honestly think, I know, Leviathan's my new number one at the park for several reasons. Is it your number one? It's gotta be now. I know it's this guy's number one. Leviathan's always been my number one. Come on, I think it's the best ride in the park. I think it's the best ride that will ever be in the park. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to beat. And the fact that they, from what we understand, I can't confirm this, but they've added weight to the front of the train. From yeah, what we've heard, to right? The front two cars, and now each train is running with 20 sets of nylon wheels, which make it go faster. Oh my goodness. And plus the wheel heaters that they added in last October. Yeah. Those are new. From last October. Yeah. I did not know that. So this ride is hauling. Like we're talking like almost ejector. And just wait till it gets 30 degrees out. <laughs> That's right. still not ejector. You know, it's close. Wow. Yeah. But not. This is my only park I wouldn't know. Yeah, that's okay. That's why you're here. <laughs> it's a learning experience, yeah. Craig. Huh? I'm about as GP as you two. <laughs> so if you haven't gotten on Leviathan this season, I definitely recommend getting on Leviathan. Go. It has yeah. to be the front. The front row, the front. yes. Oh, it's gonna blow your mind away. We just rode the front and I was trying to make a clip of me cutting Craig's hair because he got a haircut. So everyone, this is Craig's hair. I look 12. <laughs> I love that all the ride ops are like literally commenting yeah, on Yeah, they all hair. commented on my hair, but when you got your haircut, no one noticed. It's, I'm unnoticeable. I blend in the background. <laughs> um, As I'm in center frame of the shot. But, uh... Off to the side. Craig, you now look like you're, you're 12. I know. Yeah, but he has the attitude of 10 year old. Oh! I need to grow some acne or something. Oh. I don't think that's how that works, <laughs> but whatever. Um... Craig goes home, puts butter on his face. <laughs> I'll start swimming with the pizzas. Oh, is that a vlog? Hi. Hi. Hey, girl, hey. Hey, girl, hey. <laughs> Does she not know the park is closed? <laughs> I know, you're heading the wrong way. So, Leviathan's are number one. Yukon's number two for sure. And then Behemoth is like eight. Be Behemoth is falling so hard. I'm Behemoth not is enjoying that ride at it's all. The, it's those trims. Like, it's just killing the ride this year. Yeah. It's falling apart, actually. Oh, T. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Whoopsies. Oh, copyright music. No. <laughs> I was about to say worst luck, and then Craig literally blows like the juju on me. Is that how you say it? Jewel. Jewel. And it's not a jewel, but sure. Oh, okay. So what are we talking about? I'm talking about how okay I keep getting crapped on by birds on this ride. Good. Like I got crapped on again <laughs> earlier today on this ride. The first ride we got on this, and I got crapped on by a bird again. Like two days ago on Behemoth. Was that Behemoth? It was Behemoth. I swear it was this. No, sir, it was I, know, I don't know. I don't remember. Okay, I'm just getting crapped on. Oh, yeah, I remember. That was Behemoth. Was, was it? Behemoth. Okay, yeah, okay. So, <laughs> yeah, I must be doing something wrong somewhere in the world uh, with all this bad karma. Maybe the bird doesn't like you. But Surya pointed out this really awesome thing that the support columns do on roller coasters, and it's normal, by the way. Super normal. Don't worry. We saw it on Yukon. We're going to try and grab a clip on another day of Yukon support column doing this, but apparently... Leviathan's one, this one here. This one, that one, and that one, you can visibly see it do it when the trains are running. So of the big airtime hill, if you look up the support column when the trains are running, the uh, column shakes, and Syria knows why. So that's called flexoral stress. That's coupled with um, tensile tension. So what that is, is when the train goes over it, the way the circular support columns are designed to distribute the load is in a swaying motion like that. And that's to dissipate all the energy and momentum that's built up in the train so the ride doesn't crack, so the support doesn't crack or the foundation doesn't crack. So actually, if it did not shake like that, that would be a lot more troublesome and the ride shelf life would be nearly half of what it is now. So you need that flexoral stress. 
the more you know. <laughs> I had no idea. Like, I literally didn't know that they ship that much. When I saw Yukon's, I was like, whoa. If, if he didn't explain it, Brendan would be crying. Right? I'd be like, we're not going on any rides anymore. We're gonna go to Fantasy Island or something. And actually, it's a similar thing you can see in really tall skyscrapers too, like in downtown Toronto. The CN Tower, First Canadian Place, and Scotia Tower have all been documented to do that. Wow. The CN Tower's supposed to, though, doesn't it? I did feel it in the CN Tower when I was there. I remember that, and I got so queasy. If on a windy day, you can see it in the light pole. I don't when think... it shakes back and forth. I don't think that's supposed to happen. On a windy day, you can also see Craig a blow away. <laughs> honestly, honestly. <laughs> or get abducted. <laughs> By wind? My hood. My hood fills up with wind and I float off. Oh like, my god. Like Mary Poppins. Nonetheless, it's been a really good day. Like, Leviathan's hauling, Yukon was really hauling today too. Lines weren't bad. Lines weren't bad. We didn't, we have fast lane, we didn't even use it today. Like, and we still had a blast. Like, Vortex was hauling too. Was it? Yeah. yeah. That ride hasn't been impressing me this year so far, but maybe I'll give it another try. This car is this. Covered in bugs. Oh? <laughs> I think it's yours. Craig, what's your favorite row on Leviathan? Front. Obviously. Uh, yeah. You thought about it. I was gonna say the back, but front, I think. <laughs> Definitely the front. Maybe. Hopefully. <laughs> I don't know, it wasn't this fast last year though. I don't know who you're pointing it at, really there's no one standing it. there. Like, this year it's so much faster. You said it's nylon wheels are still on too. Yep. It has to be the additional weight. Yeah, the additional weight, the nylon wheels, the heaters. Man, this thing, that little low to the ground airtime hill is so awesome. Yeah. Almost better than a Fury. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to edit that out. <laughs> As he wears the Fury 325 shirt. All I'm gonna tell you, Surya, is watch this when it uploads because when you were explaining, you'll see what it was. Wait, what? Well, he was explaining. Oh, this. he was dancing behind you. Oh! <laughs> you didn't notice no, he you? No. <laughs> He's trying to show off his new haircut. He's getting blown around by the wind. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> Wow, the cameras make us look really white. I think you should just take your shirt off again. Oh, okay. oh my oh, god, no. Oh, oh. <laughs> I did buy him his summer uniform, by the way. I did buy it. Someone commented, just buy his summer uniform already. I bought it. Yeah, Brendan. I caved, I bought it. It's coming. All right, I guess that wraps up today. Get on Leviathan. And that's the message of this video. <laughs> <laughs>